tore my meniscus, like a playing soccer. So this is no ordinary boo-boo that a little band-aid can heal, like my parents thought it would. They're Mexican, they think just giving a little massage, it's gonna fix it. No, not this. So I was playing, like if you know me, I like playing soccer, like if I could, I'd be playing it right now or watching it on TV. So I worked at, I worked at indoor soccer arena down the street on McCormick and Reno, and I would play a lot because, I mean, I worked there. So I was going for a 50 ball, 50-50 ball with this girl, and I had like, went like this, so I thought, at the moment I didn't think I hurt anything because I like, I was just going for the ball, trying to win the ball, but then, after that, like whenever I woke up and tried to like get off my bed, whenever I planted on my left foot, I like literally fell off the bed because I couldn't, you know, I couldn't stand it. And then, like I didn't think anything of it, like I would have to pop, constantly pop my knee, but I didn't think like anything was really wrong with it. But, with, but when preseason started at SNU, like I couldn't, I really only did preseason for a week, and then I got taken out because they were telling me, hey, your knee's swollen, it's not getting any better. So I was doing rehab for a while, and it really didn't help at all, and, and they were like telling me I had to get an MRI to figure out what was really wrong with it. And it happened, I tore my meniscus, and I ended up getting surgery in December, it was a year ago, December 28th, I believe. So it was just like right after Christmas, it was a nice week. It was a nice Christmas present for me, I guess. So I really rushed trying to play because I wanted to play again, but it wasn't such a good idea because I feel like I tore it again. It's like I didn't feel it right, but like, it's, I don't know, it's still torn. And like at the end of the day, like I, st I don't play at SMU anymore. So I guess it was kind of like a good and bad thing because I'm actually doing something that I want to do. Like at SMU, they didn't have the police program. So I'm actually doing something that I want to do now. And I mean, I still play with it. I still play with my knee, thinking that it's still torn. But I do have to constantly pop it. And this is how it looks like. Well, it's supposed to look like. That's how it's supposed to, like, how it was. But I think how I rushed my rehab, I really didn't do it right. and. I just, like it's numb right now just standing on it, but it's probably because I'm nervous. But that's how it's supposed to look like. I was going to show you guys a video of how they were scoping it, but I think.